Okay, so to continue, then um, that's a 30 blade I use on his face, and then now what I've been doing is attaching the 30 blade to this Power Max and using the cones to change the length versus change the blades. This is probably gonna wear this blade down a lot, but that's okay um, because I've really been using this both on a clean coat and a dirty coat, so I'm assuming that at some point I'm gonna have to get another one anyway. When the blade gets hot, I cool it down with this, and when I'm done using it, if I remember, I put a blade lube on it at the end just to try to keep it going as long as possible. There are two brushes and a comb that I use quite a bit. I've learned that this brush is for brushing out. And that is really not for drying, at least for me, and not for um, um, grooming with a blow dryer. So I use this comb after I've brushed him out, after a bath, and I've dried him mostly out with these kinds of brushes. I can't remember the name but I'm sure it's better to have a picture anyway. Um, this comb I use after he's dried, after he's brushed out, and I start to want to kind of trim around the feet and such. As you can see, they're wrestling underneath me because they don't know what I'm talking about or talking to them. Okay, so scissors. I have an expensive pair. For me, expensive is like $60, and that is over here. Now these scissors can go all the way, they can get longer and they can go all the way up to like, I don't know, $300 I think. But I'm not a professional groomer, I just groom my dogs terribly. <laughs> so that's my most expensive pair. This kit, this set here, I actually purchased a scissor set. Hold on, I need to deal with this. 